Hello guys, welcome to the channel. Joffrey Noodle Eds here today. Uh, today I'm looking at a new DLC, the Cathcart Glasgow Circular Route, which is like a real high busy commuter route in Scotland. Um, most of the trains up here are run by ScotRail, and this is the uh, the first look at the DLC. I thought instead of just jumping straight on the train. I'll show you around a little bit, give you a little bit of the uh, look of the game. So, you are quite limited where you go in the game, like you can't go down here or anywhere, which is a real shame. So let's have a look at the platforms. If you've been to Glasgow Station, I'm hoping this looks a lot like Glasgow Station for you. So... Again, they can't put any sort of uh, commercial properties onto the uh, onto the game. Here we go. There's a map here. So that is the Cathcart Circle. So it sort of runs between all of those stations from Glasgow to Newton and Lilliston down the bottom there. These are little scenarios. And these are the, uh, <laughs> the dumb public. Look at him, look. He doesn't know what he's doing. He doesn't know what he's doing. Let's see if we can go down here. See, they have tried. Look, I suppose that's supposed to be um, Marks and Spencers or something. And that guy just appeared out of nowhere here. So, platforms nine. So, here's one of the Scott Rail units. It's a 314. And that's probably one of the only negative things about this DLC is. That's cool, Scottish accent. Yeah, as I was saying, it's the only unit you've got available. Um, which kind of sucks, really. Let's have a quick look at the top of the uh, platforms here. And let's have a look at the... Um, see if we can see the junctions at the front here. Wow, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I like that. Not very busy. Considering this is supposed to be a service that runs peak sort of trains. But we are 10 o'clock. Let's have a look at this train going there. As always on trains, everyone's in the back car because they're too lazy to walk to the front. <laughs> and the front's always empty. So there's a tip. If you want a bit of a quiet place on the train, uh, go to the front. So the station looks quite cool. So how about we go and jump on a train? So let's go to the main menu. We'll jump out of that and let's go to the timetable shall we and we'll choose a little service so two trains choose a route let's do the cab car timetable we'll do the 314 let's see what we've got don't want too early in the morning uh, um, that one looks quite cool let's have a little go at that one so this is my first go on it guys I have not done anything on the train yet no training or anything so I'm just hoping I can manage to set it up master key okay 
Let's pop the Versa into neutral. Um, where's me lights? Headlights. That's all you want. Um, uh, put the pan up. Hang on a minute. Have we got everything up here? And he's doing. Um, let's have a quick look. Make sure the pan's up. Um, we can unlock the door. Okay, let's go back on. Seems very, very quiet. Uh, da, 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 da. Right. Open the window. I don't seem to have any sound on my train. Let me double check everything on here is on. And I'm happy with that. That's the guard key. Um, I'm going to put me into forward. Lock me doors. Maybe we'll get some sound when we start moving. Release me brakes. And we'll get moving. Oh, that sounds good. Always try to carry water with you. If you feel free. I like the sound. Open that door. Okay. So, we're going to location Glasgow Central Line 5. Oh, it's got lovely sound over the points. Very nice. Have a little look. That looks good. Let's grab a picture. Wrong button. <laughs> okay, here we go. See what's happening now. We can increase speed to 20. So yeah, this is my first go on it. So I'm bound to make some boo-boos, guys. Um, so I've not even been on this unit before. So, uh, there we go. I don't think we're stopping at line 5, I just think that's a location that we're going via. <laughs> going uphill. Hence why we lose speed when we go into drift. We're up to 30 miles speed limit here at the moment. Got a green signal ahead. 
Next one is a yellow, so I'll keep an eye on that. This is our via point, so we don't have to stop here. We've got a yellow signal. First stop is Pollock Shells East, platform two. So we're not far from it. So let's cruise a little bit. Don't want to overshoot. I don't know what the brakes are like on this. A little bit of lag there. Guys, don't want to stop here yet, do we? There we go, that's fine. Just release my doors. Let's have a little look at this station. That's a bit of a bit of a nothing sort of station, really, isn't it? Very commutable area. Looks like there's a mosque there. A bit of hazy weather. So. <laughs> Queen's Park. Next. Wonder if there's anything to do with Queen's Park Rangers football team. The unit looks really nice. How many cars have I got? Three car. Three car unit. So again, this station's not too far away. So we don't want to overspeed. Oh, that was close. Really close stations here. I'm not worried about these markers. There we go. Lovely jubbly. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. Lovely job, eh? Another unit there. Got a post and he's going up there. But I'm not going to get out to do that. Or am I? Doing me head in.
That's better. That was doing me head in. Okay. There we are. Let's sit down again. We can close doors. And away we go again. Nice little unit to run. Very quiet. I like the local door, that's very cool. That's for the conductor. The railway needs conductors. One of the most important people on the railway. On your trains, your driver drives your train. Your conductor does everything else. So we're now stopping at Cross Hill, platform two. Not bad, I'm not far behind, am I? On the time, <laughs> it says, about a minute behind. So this is sneaking up on us as well. Some more lag. Start to bring this down a bit. Whoa, this is a weird one. Because of that wall. When I'm playing this game, and I've got more experience, I tend to turn these things off. Platform marking things. There we go. British doors. What a weird little station. Very strange. Can we see it over the side? Yeah, what a weird place to be. I quite like it though. I'm sure this time of morning, this road will be a lot busier than that. Anyway, let's get going. Okay, Mount Florida. I do like the sound. It's got a bit of an underground sound to it. Some of the uh, environment looks a bit iffy, but then some of it looks really cool. Unfortunately, we're not going to get really much faster than 25 miles an hour on this bit of the route, just due to the closeness of the stations. Very cool though. Coming in a bit too slow here, really. Could have come in a little bit faster.
Okay. Nice bit of stop in there. Oh. Let's get off. Found something else I can do here. Some flowers that in there. Is this a message board as well? Or the other side? No. Okay. They're just little things for you to do. For your safety and comfort, this station operates a no smoking policy. This includes the e-cigarettes. I must congratulate um, Dovetail on actually putting in Scottish voices. Cathcart. Next stop. We're a couple of minutes behind, but that's normal. It's my first time on the route, and I, I messed about at the beginning, didn't I? Sort of like, uh, oh, where's the sound? Where's that? I should have just cracked on with it. Oh well. That's a bit annoying, got a little bit of lag on this. Look at that, we're getting over 30 miles an hour. Woohoo! But don't get too excited because I've got to come down to 20. Got a speed limit of 20. Do I get out here and swap pens? Don't know. Don't know this route. I wouldn't have thought so. Brakes are really slow on this. <coughs> Just make you aware of it if you haven't got this. So this is Capcart. Okay. <laughs> Dovetail do an amazing job at the graphics so then you look around and then there's that <laughs> oh well so get moving going up to gear two because we're on a uphill very end next stop
it's not a bad little rum. It's um, it reminds me of on a, uh, the Peniston line where where I work, where it's like a stop every two minutes. It's very similar to that. <laughs> Just gonna glide here at thirty odd miles an hour just because that that snick stop is creeping up quick. And the brakes are excruciatingly slow on this. Yeah, painfully slow brakes. Okay. Have a look here. Long button. Oh, I like that. Oh. Poster. Let's have a crack on that, shall we? Should it work? Yeah, look at that. Cool. Stop messing around, Joff. That's why you're falling behind. Okay, what's next? William Wood. William Wood in the over a mile. Oh, can we get some speed up here? Brilliant sounds, I have to say that. So far, looking at this, the pluses, the sounds, the train's great, the interior looks amazing, really awesome job. Um, exterior, it's good, and it's not. <laughs> it's that looks fantastic. But it's when you go higher, and you look over here, it can look a bit, yeah, okay, that doesn't look right. But, you know, you're here for the train, ain't you? So, it's not too bad. But considering this is a Train Simwell 2 DLC, uh, being played on Train Simwell 3, on the PS5, it's not bad. They have released another Scott Rail one. Um, but it's 30 quid, and I, I will not pay that. I will wait to see when it gets a price drop. Then I'll think about getting it. And that's uh, a Train Sim World 3 DLC. For the PS5, that should be quite cool. Just bringing my speed down slightly, just because I know the brakes on this are not brilliant. I like to be in control of that. Have we got a left hand side this time? All, the, all of them so far have been island platforms. This is a, a proper traditional platform, this one.
Oh, that sound was amazing. That was a great little sound. Let's have another little picture. There we go. Again, station's not much to look at. I must admit, the stations are quite um, minimalistic, is probably the word. But again, these are little suburban sort of stations. Um, so you're going to get that. You really are. Let's watch the door shut from the stairs. Very cool. Nice sounds. Oh, that's lovely sounds. Like I've said, absolutely spot on when it comes to the sound. Stop when that white craigs now. There are scenarios on this as well as um, obviously a timetable. And uh, it's, 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 it's good, but it's just you can't get going, can you? Because it's like, you know. station it's weird having to break so early um, before you even get to the station really It's a meadow. <laughs> nice. See, that looks a bit better, doesn't it? Just Pat, is it Patterton? <laughs> He's thinking, oh, God, I miss me trying that. Oh, that was nice, a bit of electric there, from the overhead wire. See if we get any more.
No, nope, didn't get any more sparks. So I'll just bring in my speed down slightly as we're approaching our station. We're about two minutes behind. Yes. I am enjoying it. It's a really relaxing uh, little ride, this. So this is, I don't know how many more stops we've got left. We're heading to uh, Nilston. Does it tell me on the board? Calling that. Nilston, so it's the next stop. So it should be my last stop now. in three miles time. Hopefully we'll be able to get a bit of speed up now. Not a bad little run, was it? Imagine doing this route every day though. It would soon get boring, wouldn't it? If you worked on this route every day. Anyway, let's see what we can do with a bit of time. We are at full throttle. Look at me stepping out at 50 miles an hour. We can step this bad boy up to 55 now. got to come back down to 50 miles an hour. Oh well. We've got a little way yet though. Just keep an eye on our green signals. Well, I hope you've liked this little stream. 
It's not going to be a long one. This is just the first look at this uh, new line we got um, that we picked up. So I thought we'd just give it a little look at today. It's nice. This is my first Scottish line, I think. It'd be good to get a line on the North Wales coast up by Clandidno and Carnarvon and Bangor. That would be a really cool route to get. We still need a proper one out King's Cross up to Leeds or to Cambridge or to to Peterborough. That's what would be really cool. getting quite close now so I'm going to put myself down to a, a coast knowing how these brakes are then it comes down gradually on its own So when we get there, it'll be the end of this little uh, trip. I hope you've liked the first look at this uh, cat cart um, line. Our first look at it. It's quite cool. That sneaked up, didn't it? So this is the end of the line. Lovely. Let's open the doors. Again, a bit of a nothing station. All our trains and stations are no smoking areas. Please do not smoke until you have left the station premises. This includes e cigarettes. So, thanks for watching, guys. This will probably end this little scenario.